Hi everyone, my name is Stacy Martin and I'm a Senior Director of Customer Success at Quotient. This is my beautiful daughter, Ava. She's 20 years old and she is a lot of fun. Hi, um, I'm Kim Weber. I work on the Strategy and Insights team at Quotient. Um, and my kids, I have three kids. I have a, a, st a stepdaughter who is 24 and in the adult range. I have a nine-year-old son who's my cameraman right now. Thanks, Evan. And I have this one who's almost seven. How many days are you seven? What, 15. 15 days, and she'll be seven. My name is Grace Miners Moran, and I am a sales trainer here at Potion. I have one baby. He is six months old, almost. Uh, his name is Oscar. Hi, my name's Ashley and I'm a director of marketing at Quotient. I work on the coupons.com side and I am a first time mom this year and a baby in a pandemic. The, she was born the first week after lockdown. Mwah. A crazy story I've had from working for home at Quotient this year is I was on a Zoom call and holding my daughter in my lap. She was about five months old and she had a big blowout. So I immediately went to her nursery and changed her and me. There was just lots of poop everywhere. Um, and from the other room I heard, Ashley, Ashley, it's your time to present. Where's Ashley? It wasn't gonna happen. A funny thing that has happened um, with my kids while working from home was when my toddler decided to rip his uh, diapers completely off and poop all over the living room. And he also proceeded to scream poopy during the call while I was speaking. So that was fun. I would say the thing that sticks out in my memory the most was uh, one time I was on a particularly long call and someone was getting a little anxious that I wasn't spending enough time with him. He proceeded to stand in front of me and pee everywhere. Oh, yeah. yeah, oh my goodness, it was fun. Probably the funniest thing was I had just done a recording and it was, it was, I don't know, 10 or 12 minutes and I had just finished it and in walked my little guy and he said, Mommy, I need some help wiping. And so I had to redo the whole thing. So I smiled and that was pretty funny. As for my mom, um, what's been the hardest for her this year is definitely not seeing her grandkids. She's got 11 of them and she has not been able to spend the time that she likes with her grandkids. So I know that's been difficult. I'm guessing here, but I would guess that what's been hard on my mom this year, on your grandma, um, and and on your Mimi, your, your other grandma too. I would guess that what's been hard on her is probably not being around these little grandkiddos as much as she would like to. She had some extra family at home. So my husband and I were very um, kind of crazily displaced. Uh, we had plans to move somewhere. It did not work out because of the pandemic. So we found ourselves living with my parents um, in my parents' basement, hey! <laughs> and we had a baby there. So I think um, it was such a blessing in disguise. Uh, so I think it was probably hard for my mom and my parents to adjust to having us be back. But then once the baby came, then it was awesome. So I think also it might've been, I think it was pretty hard for them when we left. So the hardest part about this year on my mom has probably been that she's only been able to see her kids and her grandkids about twice. And that was in a parking lot with masks. <laughs> and she hasn't been able to meet her new granddaughter yet. <laughs> I would say, um, you know, the pandemic and not getting to see, you know, my mom as much this year and, and her not getting to spend quality time with him this year has really been hard. Um, she was so gracious and, and actually helped a lot when he was born and I went back to work. So. They got pretty close while she was at home. I think what we'll do for our grandmothers is get them some pretty flowers. There's a bunch of coupon codes that are now up on coupons.com so we can brighten their days. I'm gonna get my mom some flowers from 1-800-Flowers this year. And there is a promo code for 10% off on coupons.com. Something I might get for my mom this year, uh, probably a pair of shoes. My mom is not someone who spends money on herself. So I think I'm gonna check out the Macy's uh, link on coupons.com for 30% off of 
one care. I am getting my mom a bouquet of flowers because she loves floral arrangements, but I know this year has been hard on everybody, so I wanted to elevate it. And thanks to coupons.com, I found a 15% off promo code at Pro Flowers, which means as a subscription <laughs> service, I can actually get my mom a bouquet of flowers every month instead of just for Mother's Day. So thank you, mom. We love you so much.